Ladies and gentlemen, BKB presents three two minute rounds of bare knuckle boxing. Introducing first, in the blue corner, representing Leeds, making his second outing in the BKB ring, Danny Fletcher. Across the ring, his opponent stands in the red corner, representing Farnborough, making his fifth outing in the BKB ring, Pat Nash! Ian John Lewis is our referee in charge of the action. Boxers, boxers. Oh, and the referee, I by my command at all times. He ground through the rules, watch the heads, kick them punches up. No holding, no fingers. And remember, to defend yourselves at all times, touch them up. Ian Lewis, Let's the man in control for this famous referee. Well title for referee from the boxing board of control. Correct. Now with BKB, of course, great referee. We're underway. We've got three two-minute rounds. They're fighting at 67 kilos. Oh, oh clash of heads there. Straight away, yeah, Tom. I noticed that straight clash of heads. Both fighters going toe to toe and uh, uh, holding and hitting. I think the referee's got a, a little word there, and he, he did. He split them up easily. Because the one thing about BKB, unlike others, you can't hold and hit. Nice body shots Good. coming in there from... Uh, we talk about body shots all Danny the time. Fletcher, beautiful. Oh, great stuff. Back comes Nash as well with some nice body shots. Blood on already. Yeah. Great oh. inside work from yeah. both Both fighters, yeah, Gareth. Both working Gareth, inside. Gareth, when we talk about... To these are toe-to-toe -to -toe merchants, front foot fighters, both of them. Well, it's a 14-foot ring. It's like four phone boxes put together, basically, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> great work yeah. from Nash here, in my view. Well, Nash has pushed him off and pushed him in the corner where he wants him. Now he's working the body. But, but you know when you've clashed heads, you know when you've had this, you know in your mind you're in a fight here. You've got to do or die, isn't it, for both fighters. But Nash is changing levels very yeah. well, in my view, in that inside work. They're both pausing now. Cagey work, phony war going on now, looking for openings. Lovely work, love, great left to And a yeah. left to the body. Great stuff there from Fletcher. Up. Fletcher there and the body again. We talk about it all the time. Use it. We never saw the body shot for three years. Yeah. Now we now we see, see the, the skills of yeah. yeah the skills of the skill levels of raised. We see all the technical ability from fighters. Fletcher winning this round for me, guys, at the moment. He's done the better work and again with that left hook. But a right coming yeah, in comes Nash. from Nash. What a great oh, fight! And a great right hook. Great again from Nash. Again, they're trying desperately to. Get that edge. They know that the judges will be looking at all. Oh, oh, Fatigue on Fletcher ten seconds. at the moment. Fatigue there. Both fighters now. Trading blows. There's the bell. Oh, oh the bell is gone. I don't think that'll count. The bell, the bell had gone. I'm pretty, I don't think that'll count. For me, Fletcher in the last 30 seconds of that round suddenly looked very fatigued. Yeah. Was gasping for air. And, he for and that Nash took advantage of it. That'll take a lot out of him. Here we go for the second of three rounds. And already that's a 10-8. And Nash comes looking now for, whoa, good stuff again. Good body oh, work from winning. Fletcher. Fletcher now, oh, trading amazing. blows. Boom, boom, boom. And then got to himself out there a little bit, but then, you know? But then, I told you how tough Nash was. He never knows when he's beaten the guy. He comes back. Tries to team. Oh, oh down. That's a, that's that's a, a knockdown. That's a count. That's a count. Fletcher almost taking a knee from yep. fatigue. Yeah. I was just about or to needing yeah. a rest, yeah. Robin. He's like more fatigued, I think, than more, like you say, yeah, Gareth, than an actual punch. You can see him breathing heavy now while he's taking that count. This is my debut event. I'm not joking. The adrenaline coursing through my body is incredible right now. Well, the referee will have a little look at him. It's 2 10 8, so Fletcher's got to knock him out to win the fight as it stands. I just. Nash will be told now. Nash will know what he's got to do. And Nash has made Fletcher tentative now, hasn't yeah. he? Oh, good Here stuff. he goes again, Nash working well on the inside, body shots. Tough as they come. And Fletcher comes back, though. Courage, raw courage from both. Oh, great body shots. What a body shot that was. He turned Fletcher. Down he goes again. 
And Fletcher, by the way, uh, sorry, Nash, by the way, just flexing his right hand as he went to the neutral corner. He's damaged his right hand, and I imagine that's a, a prerequisite. In this I would, kind of I would fight. think that most He's fighters just flexing it, Tom. Most like fighters it's very hurt. Most fighters hurt. They, they, you wouldn't recognise their hands when they finish. Whoever they are, win, lose, or draw. 15 seconds to go in the round now as they re-engaged. Ian John Lewis hang up a very, very close look yeah. at Fletcher. Here we go. One more knockdown. Uh, one more knockdown would do it. Yeah, he needs to survive this round. Yes, Tom. absolutely. Ten seconds left. Oh. Just needs to make this round. And there it is. Final round. Here we go. And Nash has, has looked as good as I've seen him, but he's always competitive. Yeah, and I know Nash, Tommy, he, he's never going to take a back, backwards no. step. For his height, his reach, and look, he wants to fight on the inside. He wants to tear up. He wants to tear up non, non, non-stop. I love his high hand work, yeah. though, because he's fainting and he's moving, he's th- edging forward. He's almost conning Fletcher at the moment. Well, you'll see more, more of the, this, you'll see. You'll see a lot of that where they, they almost say, all right, and they... Jimmy Sweeney's the best at getting your attention on that hand and hitting you with the other. It's, you're teasing people to do something. I think Fletcher's in survival mode. He's looking for that big left and right hand. Oh, body again. Brilliant. Brilliant. Only, only a minute and 15 to go now, Tom. So he's, he's got done it. 75 seconds. But can it change in an instant, yeah, that's this the, sport? That's absolutely, which is why I said keep out of trouble. Yeah, that's the beauty of BKB. You never know what's going to happen. But one There's punch. no holding and no escaping the action, yeah. is there? You can't hold and punch. And, and, of course, a winning punch, you could damage your knuckles and you're out of the fight. So there's so many ifs and buts in this fight game. It's never over till it's over. I think Nash is trying to protect his right hand at the moment that's horribly damaged and he's had problems with his left, I could see, in the mutual corner. Just trying to get through this oh. now. Doesn't want to throw that right. Well, he's throwing the left now all the throwing time. The left. See, that's what I was saying before when you said when you're asking me what you would you do. Now. I'd stay close. I know what you're saying is head on point, stay away. But I think that's dangerous for Nash. You know, he, he's working better on the inside. I can see that Fletcher. He must be able to see it. Fletcher's for starting fatigue. So the more he keeps it on him, yeah. I mean, I think he's he, 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 keeping it at range is, is going to. Um, Give uh, uh, Fletcher the Fletcher's invite. Got ten but seconds look, for the knockout. Look at Fle- look at Fletcher's face. He's already gassed out. Beaten. Beaten. That's it. He goes to work again on the inside. I'm looking at his he right. He won hand. the last round, Tom. Don't maybe, you? maybe, maybe he just might have been the better. He knows he's won the first tackle. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of non-stop action, we consult the judges' scorecards. I can tell you it's a unanimous decision. To the red corner, Pat Nash! Come sit down, brother. What a fantastic win. Thanks, mate. How do you feel? Fucking fantastic. Well deserved win, my bad. I've had so many close fights. And now with this one, I'll put everything into this. You're absolutely right. And for me, what done in the fight was your tactics. Yeah. It was fantastic tactics. You stepped in, you was being really cheeky with some of the head holes. And when you caught him with that uppercut, it changed the fight. Yeah. When you hit him with that, what was you thinking? Yeah, exactly the same. Now first, the first time I went down with the uppercut, I just looked at him thinking, I ain't coming back for this. I've got to put the pressure on. And I did that, and now look, come, finally got one of these things. Fantastic, Rick. What's next? Um, I've got broken hands at that hill. And then back out here, obviously. Do you have a particular name that you like to call out? No, nah, I don't like calling people out, mate. You never know if you lose against it, it looks worse, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, well, say, enjoy your rest, rest your hands, and we look forward to seeing you back, Thanks, Nash. Dan. Well Appreciate done. It, mate. Absolutely well done. Thank you, thank you. Excellent stuff. Excellent stuff from Pat Nash and Dan Chapman. Wonderful stuff. I Did mean... he lose those teeth tonight, or was that before, no. by the way? <laughs> Brilliant. Brilliant stuff. This, here the we go. Here's the uppercut. uppercut. Oh, oh really shot. great yeah, shot. shot. He got in great position, and a, and a great left from Fletcher to come back, but straight away. There it is. Do you know what I liked about that? You'll know, Robin. He teed him up with the left, left and then and boom. Brought it up, he, yeah. he, he actually set the shot Beautiful. up. Beautiful. There it is again. And rotated all night. through the yeah. right hand, didn't yeah. he? Through the hips. Textbook, the textbook, up, the textbook uppercut. We were talking last night. The power doesn't come from the punch. The no, power it comes, comes from, from your knees. Your knees and your face. Exactly. That's where the power comes from. But it was a good scrap, wasn't it? Oh, Let's be fair. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely good scrap. Yeah. I mean, look at him. It's like, it is like ballet dancing, isn't it? 
it is, isn't it? Apart from, well, the fact that there's no choreography and the dancers hit each other, but that's, you, that's exactly the way I see these Do you know people. what I admire about Nash and Fletcher? Neither of them had had a win in bare knuckle coming into this. Yes. Yeah, look at the vim and vigour they delivered.